Now, ladies and gentlemen, comes the perennial question, what is swing? Well, of course, we've all heard the famous definition uh, that originally was attributed to Duke Ellington and some people say Louis Armstrong, some people say U.B. Blake or Fats Waller, is that if you don't know what swing is, then you definitely ain't got it. Okay, well, that's a, a definition that speaks for itself. But you know what? Let's go to Webster's Encyclopedic Unabridged Dictionary. Uh, of the English language. And let's find out what they say about swing. And let's see, we're looking up swing here. And uh, I, don't know, I don't know if you can see it, but there's an entire column on the word swing. And there are, at first glance, 39 different definitions of swing that have nothing to do with music. Now, a little further down, here's what we have. Swing music, a style of jazz popular especially in the 1930s and often arranged for a large dance band marked by a smoother beat and more flowing phrasing than Dixieland, true, and having less complex harmonies and rhythms than modern jazz, such as bebop, also true. But here's the definition that uh, I think is most important. Swing is the rhythmic element that excites dancers and listeners to move in time to jazz music. Now, in a previous segment, uh, we demonstrated something with a very, uh, a very flat rhythm to it, and then did the same thing with swing. Uh, and those of you who might be dancers or who go to concerts and uh, enjoy tapping your foot and clapping your hands to the music, um, you see which one interests you the most. Let's try a, uh, uh, a Fats Waller hit, uh, a McEwen Fields tune from the 30s uh, called Spread and Rhythm Around and let's do it completely flat of any swing at all and see what happens. If you were to read the sheet music that was published in the 1930s, uh, you would pretty much uh, be playing what I just played. Uh, but let's consider the fact that it was placed in the hands of Fats Waller. He performed it uh, uh, in a movie, I think The King of Burlesque was the name of the movie, uh, and it's called Spread and Rhythm Around. And let's take that same tune and play it the same way that Fats interpreted it in the movie. and swing into the basic uh, element and rather than go into a bunch of um, English language definitions and a bunch of technical explanations, uh, pretty much all you have to do is to listen to the difference between those two versions and then you will know what swing is so that when somebody asks you what swing is, you tell them to go on YouTube and check out this video.